Welcome back to another another three another <laughs> another dynamic threesome over here with the uh, with the with the Barbobbly boys, and uh, I'll be your host. Uh, Any more steps? Any I'll be your host. Any more sti- Any more steps? I had a step from chat the other day. No, you didn't. Can we do? Uh, can we pick our color identity by randomly picking card slots? No. I I'm gonna just I'm gonna say it. I don't like doing steps if if people have not commissioned them, and the reason is because uh, I just throw away money when I do that. It's 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 unlikely that you're it's it's rare. Are you asking me to pay for the draft? No, I'm just saying let's just do a draft normally and not stip- have a stipulation. How about we do pick pick pick? He just said no. I said that last time. Yeah, let's do that last time. That's what fine. The f- that's not really a stip. No, that's not a stip. That's just a fun way to draft. Five hundred bits for the Frank Mike and Soul Mike. Acer, hey, thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. Always, always appreciate. Always appreciate. Why does this open up over here? Jesus, can you open up on the friggin' window that I closed you on? That is frustrating. Whatever, I guess that's fine. How about a trophy step? You must trophy? That's a good one. Oh, man. Relax. I'll never get that one. All right, I will pick first, then Mike, then Rob, or how do you want to do it? Let's Doesn't do it like this. Can you guys? You guys should Rochambeau. What does this mean? It goes like this. Okay. So. But right, couldn't it also Rob go like me. this? That's why I couldn't. I couldn't tell. I felt like you were changing motions. I think this motion. is no. We'll go clockwise, right? So me, Rob, Mike. Right. That's what I meant. But you didn't Rob. say that. You didn't say that, mutual. But that's what I meant by doing this. See now you're doing that. That's different than what you're doing before. Mucho, listen to me. I'm going to pick first. I'm going to pick... Mold Drifter. Excuse me. Don't influence my pick. Excuse me. Slam the Goth. Destroy them all. Slam the Goth. Okay. We're allowed to talk about picks. I think that's fine. <laughs> Team effort. Hmm. <laughs> Well, you alright? Hey. You okay? I didn't notice you put those on, man. I slid them down with a quickness. That's... Have you ever played against Koth? I played with Koth. Koth bring down with... the hammer. Koth played with me. Your, your pick. Oh, shit. Sorry. Take it easy, man. I know what I'd take. I know Thank what I'd you. Take. Dragon Lord Slumgar. That's not it. That's not what I would take. That isn't what I would take. What would you take? I would take something to go with our red card. I would take the exquisite firecraft personally. Yeah, me too. Yeah, but if we're at that point, then we're just drafting red. We're not even picking our own cards. No, you get to pick your own red card. Oh, okay. ZJ, well, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Man, one whole year? Unbelievable. What a time to be alive. If I knew he was going to do that, you should have just took a mold drafter. I know. I was just trying to... Well, we didn't know that was in there, though. We didn't know what was in there. The Slumgar. Well, we had a feeling that there would be there would be cards in there. Oh. Okay. Well, since we took Slumgar, pick whatever you want, man. I'm gonna pick Masker Worm. It's the this is the worst three pick first picks ever. Grixis, dude. <laughs> Cough is not Grixis. Well, I was hoping you'd follow suit and be like, "All right, let's draft the red deck." Then I'll take the exquisite firecraft. And then we could have had the f- sweet red deck. And then, and then, sub perk, we would have been able to win sooner and go get food sooner. That was what I was trying to oh. slowly, uh, yeah. But you're like, no, I'd rather take a grindy six drop and invalidate our first pick. So I was like, okay, I guess that's that's a strategy. This is, just, this is exactly like the Sphinx Rev. Savannah. I don't, I don't this know if it's the, the strategy I would implore, but it's a strategy certainly. These are the three best picks. Yeah. Relax and Sam, you send 15 bucks right now. We're, we're sticking them on a red right away. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Jeez. Hurry up before the next pick comes in. 15 bucks per turn. Well, there's no red card here, so it still works out. Maybe he's right. Send in your 15 bucks. Take is pretty good. Excuse me, I can hear you. You already picked, though. They were both good. Both good. 
I have to destroy this actually. What is that? What happened to it? Uh, they sent me a new one because the the uh, the ear on this one came off. So now I can actually just. Oh, there we go. I wonder if I can take the helmet off too. Use your teeth. I don't want. I don't want to do that. God, his hair looks. You're supposed to destroy these things. Yeah. Why? Uh, so they have proof that you just didn't get an extra one. You get to like send them a picture. Yeah. Are you serious? Yes. That's cool. Yeah, they sent me a replacement head. And, oh, and a replacement. This seems, like, this seems dangerous. It does. What is that thing? What is what thing? In his hand. That? Yeah. Stormbreaker. Is that a different hammer? Yes. Yeah. Oh, sweet. How'd he get this one? He, uh, your mom gave it to him as a gift. Holy shit. So this is, I don't know if you guys, uh, uh, you probably don't know. This is a this is a Thor head, though, for a premium format. Sideshow premium forehead. Format forehead. Thor. Premium forehead Thor. You got a Rob's forehead. pick. Oh, God, there's so many good cards in this pack. Please pick one of them. God, I, well, I know you want Thief of Sanity, but I kind of want him to Thor. Um, pick what you want. He's going to get mad at me. I'll, I'll, get, I'll, I'll get mad at you anyway. Yeah, that's true. Pick the him to Thor. <laughs> Yeah, that's a good point. He'll get mad at me anyway. <laughs> I think he went with him. Just kidding. <laughs> Just kidding. Do it. No, why would I do that? That's that's so shitty. I think we got a mono black brewing here, boys. With our what? With the dragon lord song? Three out of our five cards. We can them? like we can splash him. So it's well, not mono black. Splash. Yeah, that's it's close enough. It's it's, not. it's just like last draft. Mono black splash it's... three cards. How do you break the hammer? I don't, I don't know. I'm just going to get a hammer and smash it with a hammer. So, like, literally you just have to break it to show that it's destroyed, right? Can I break it? Uh, Can I break it off of his, out of his hand? Not right this second. No, I want to be able to do it outside so it's not. Uh, don't make a mess. Just give me the things and we'll break it later. We can break it together. Hmm. Mutual, don't mess this up. There's one good card in here. Maybe there's, two. There's, like, two good cards in here. One's better than the other, though. I'm going to go with Doomblade. That's a good choice. Gosh, what so was crazy. the other one you were gonna take? Essentially, Mutavault. Mutavault in, in our in our triple black masker uh, worm deck. In our potentially three color deck. Okay, we're not playing Koth. Don't kid yourself. We are with that Kavu, bro. You know how many mountains we're gonna get, you stupid Mitch. There's a mountain right there. I could take this too. Yeah, dude. I like this one. This pack's actually very good. I agree. You hear that dude outside? Oh, bow, bow. Malicious affliction's pretty gas too. That's all right. I'm really tired. I'm really over, like, destroying non-black creatures. Like, it's just, it gets really old. Mm. I'm really glad that's not a black trope anymore, because it's super obnoxious. I think it is Deluge. <laughs> it's just a good one to have. Why can't we be friends? Why can't we be friends, guys? We could. It's up to you. All right. Well, then I don't want to be. It's a murderous red cap. Don't pick that. How bad do you want to play God, Michael? Not very much. <laughs> okay. Well, we got Deluge, Ob, Doomblade, and Massacre Worm. I really don't think we need Never. 15 seconds. Um, uh, don't forget Never Destroys a Planeswalker, planeswalker which is extremely yeah. relevant. That's fine. Take the Never. Never. Ooh. We got Treasure Map, Fatal Push, and nope. Drana. Wow. I didn't, the, I didn't see that at all. The card I'm looking at is literally none of those three. Yeah. Oh, well, okay. I, I'm not going to go there. What are you thinking about Bedeviled? Yeah. We want to play the car. You don't want to play the Koth. I don't give a shit about Koth. I think Grixis is fine though, and this card is also. I don't want to. I don't want to keep influencing you guys. If all you see well, is black, the stream might be broken. Unless you're referring to the, the no, deck. Let's just keep with the, the theme. We have one I'll second, dude. Take it. I don't know what to take. I just took Bedevil because it was the, it was the one card that I. Don't put it. You in guys my have pile. to be vigilant of time. Like. Don't put it in my pile. Thank you. Why are you taking red cards? I hate you. Memory bug, keep on rolling. Um, I'll let you know when it's your pick. 21 seconds. Oh, yeah, my bad. 
<laughs> My, <laughs> My God. Now over your pick. Mississippi Moon over here. Catacombs. Thank you for doing the right God. thing. God. Thank God. What the? Come on, Savannah. Let's let's take it easy. I'm the only one that ever makes bad picks, huh? You can't have an opinion. Man, you were salty about this cue. Still am a little bit, but you know it's whatever. I don't want to have an opinion. Crypty boy. I like it. I like it. This deck is still mono black, actually. We were splashing one red or one blue card, but. Keep on rolling, Michael. So, does he pick the first card of the next pack? I don't know. I just work here, man. What's your favorite archetype in this format? Turtles. Mono blue turtles. Very common. Your pick, Mutual. Gee, I wonder what it's going to be. Uh, the next set comes out April 26th, or, I think. 25th online. Dude, hey, it's that's actually sick. Playable. That's actually insane with Cryptbreaker and Gravecrawler. Yeah, wow. Is. <laughs> it is. And this and is a zombie. Reaper. Wow. Uh, Rob, Rob, you, Rob, you'll pick first in this one. We'll change the order. Okay. 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 Huh? Okay. Hmm. I'm going to go like this because we're going to have to make second columns. So. Hmm. Okay. That's my Rob voice. Okay. Seems pretty easy to me. Does it? I have no idea. I don't. I, I don't think this is an easy pick at all. I think it's either it's either hippie water grave or go for the throat. But we're not in blue firmly, so that's why I don't want to take watery grave. And we have a lot of removal. Remove removal. I'm gonna take the hippie. I think that was a good choice. What would you have taken? Watery. Really? Mm -hmm. We don't have enough blue. If we had like two more blue cards, I would have taken watery. I would snap taken it. Anyway, it's mutual's pick now. Go ahead, pick mutual. This should be easy for you, Mr. Watergrave. Easy pick, Watergrave. <laughs> pick the fucking mob. Well, I like Beautiful Strix. I like Reanimate. Go on. I'm listening. Tell me more. I just want to reanimate. Yeah. Are you really taking reanimate? I love yeah. that, dude. All right. That's weird, but okay. It gets out of their graveyard, too. No, that's cool. Ooh. That's a cool story, dude. Cool story. Thank you for the there's, there's, there's two good cards here. There's, 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 there's two good cards here. There's two good cards here. I'm Rob, and I don't have a family. Uh. What the fuck? <laughs> you met my family. Yeah, that was your fake family. You paid those people. That's a Splinter Twin he just clicked on. <laughs> uh, could just be Looter. No, we're taking Splinter Twin. It's too strong. Jesus. Too strong. <laughs> uh, Emrakul. Really? Yep. You're snapping it off? Yep. Well then. Too strong. We can animate it for 13 life. I mean, yes. <laughs> Michael, it's your pick. Hurry up. How many of the how many of the avatars can you name? The avatars? Yeah, and the draft. Uh, no, don't, don't hover. Oh, it doesn't tell you the name. It just tells you the player's name. Oh, I'm sorry. My bad. Uh, Balance, Jace, Birds of Paradise, Carrie Zev. That I don't know. It was just those top two I didn't know. Uh, this is a demon of some sort. I forgot which one. Ragavan and Birds. Um, 
It's your pick, you know. Yeah. Pick. Okay, just making sure you know. Um, just gotta I keep. Yes, whip. Whip. Actually, take faithless looting. That goes well with our reanimate. My dude. It's also a fine card. Oh, I like this one. Yeah, I'm taking this. It's a Robert's pick. Ultimate price. That's sad. Oh, talk about goes good with our deck. So we got Doom Whisper, we got Heroes Downfall, and we got Mind Shadow. I just want the Whisper. And Summit. Whisper. You don't want this on color fixing land? Oh, uh, maybe. I didn't see that. I'll oh, take that. Okay. <laughs> Woo! I like the Whisperer there. Over a first Fixing Land? Yeah, we could just be in two colors. That's still... You still want Fixing Lands when you have double, 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 triple, double. Like, I think you're... I think you're still interested in that. You have six Steel Hellkite. Why didn't you take spawn? I can't believe you didn't take 4-4 four, four flyer with trample for 4. You took a stupid ultimate price? Why is it going to be stupid? Because it's not smart. Then it can be just like okay. No, it's stupid. I like, know you feel that way. Like, <laughs> like you. It's stupid like you, dad. <laughs> what are you laughing at? Courtney said, watch, Ultimate Price wins us a game. <laughs> you should have responded with, no, you have to type in the passcode or use your thumbprint. <laughs> so, like, it, someone just asked me, is the iPad unlocked? Like, is, like, if it's not cellular, it, it doesn't, that's not relevant, right? Uh, yeah, I think, I don't think so. No, it's not relevant. Thank it's you. just a Wi-Fi device. Right. Whose hmm. pick is it? I pick Steel Hellkite, so it's yours. Oh, God, I want the Bob. Why do you want a Bob? Like, we have six mana cards and seven I mana know, cards I'm in our deck. Take like, the Bob. The Phoenix. Like five, four, four, seven, six, like Phoenix. Phoenix. Just Phoenix. I don't even like Necrotol. Dude. It's terrible. It's bad. But I mean it's better than these. Could take Iona and discard and reanimate. Yeah, I'd rather just take the Iona in the case in case that works out. Yeah. Is Chupacabra in there? It's gotta be a fan. Yes, yeah, there's Chupacabra. four. There's Chupacabra, yeah, Bone Shredder, Necrocall, and uh what's the other one? Oh, wow. Kalidus? That's really nice. That's really nice. Another zombie, right? He's a zombie, too, I think. No, he's not. He's a vampire. He makes uh, zombies. He makes zombies. That's right. Choosing Bob is for players with big balls. Whose turn is it? It's Rob's pick. Blood gas. Okay. I mean, just because there's three cards, I'm not going to not let you guys pick. Shriek Maul. That was the other one. Skimmall. Skimmall, sh sh as, as Relax and Sam would say. Skymall? Skymall. Skymall. What'd you say? Freight Magazine. Skymall? Yeah. Huh. Rob, you free Wednesday night or no? This coming Wednesday? Yeah. Uh, no, Wednesday, Thursday, I have games. That's stupid. I mean, it's not. But it is, if you think about it. No, it really isn't, though. I want you to think about it real hard. Could have got Shrusko's with two us. Two seconds. Okay. Shrusko's? Shrikas? Shrikas? Shrusko's? Uh, Parallax Wave, I guess. We can just put this in. Man, Mike picking a lot of white cards here. Oh, that's actually... That's playable. I'm on it. Also, we get reanimate, so, you know. Reanimate! Michael's up first. So much pressure. Oh, we have Rhyme Rhymes. 
I do too. I'll, I don't know how it would be in here, but if I get a black lotus, it's, boy, I will take it. It's a good idea. Do one of you guys fart? You have asked that like 700 times. Maybe. Because you keep farting. <laughs> Is it a fart if it smells good? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, a fart has very specific properties. <laughs> like, it's still a fart guess, even oh, if it smells good. Can you hear me now? Is that better? He's said it a few times about you talking about it. Ooh. Ex Hame. Your pick. It's your first pick. No yeah, influence. I know. I'm just thinking. I mean, it's like the only card in the pack. No, it's not. What does Theater of Horrors do again? Card advantage, friend. Card advantage. <laughs> it's, it's all right. Beginning of your upkeep, exile the top card right. during your turn. If a opponent lost life this turn, you lose life. Okay. Including yeah. lands. Uh, yeah, I mean, you just take the exhum. There's not really anything in this pack. He took Parallax Reef, so yeah, that's him. Zombie Tribal. <laughs> when the mic bites. Michael B. Yeah. Lives in the trash can. Was this me? Yep. Oh, we have a Splinter Twin? We do. That does win the game. Also, it's just very good on its own as well. Oh, shoot. <laughs> easy. Easy peasy, Japanesey. Was it that easy? Yes, it was extremely easy. But was it Japanesey? I couldn't say. I'm not. I don't. I don't How big is con Zealous Constructs? 33. No, I don't know. I want to see if I get it. I'm here. I'm crowed. That's what I think of you. Skyboat. Really? I think Skyboat's pretty good. I think it was pretty good in the uh, in the last one. Well, that was in a deck with no removal. Correct. That was a deck with no removal. Okay, I would have taken like Solemn Simulacrum here. I thought about that, but then I was like, we're only in two colors. Or Brain Maggot. But it's not about the it's not about the fixing. It's about the ramp because we have things like Massacre Worm and Book Garden Hellkite, and like we just want. We want to make sure we hit five lands here. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's going to be my pick. That's a good one. That is a good one. Dicky, dicky. This deck's looking pretty good. It's looking better if Rob didn't take all these terrible cards like Dragon Lord Solemgar. Oh, is it me? I think the oh, pick was boy. fine for the time. Oh, I like an Angrath here. Yeah, it is your, it is your pick. Oh, is Recurring Nightmare just better? I don't think so. You don't think Recurring Nightmare is better than Angrath? No. Really? Mm, not so sure about that, dog. Angrath is good, though. I don't know, we don't have any loops. In the drive, in a, I said driveway. What's the driveway? In the graveyard. Put it in the driveway. Angrath is a card that I keep getting have it, have it keep having it played against me, and my opponents just end up killing me with it. The card's great. It's very good. It deals with it kills a creature on board. It deals damage, makes them discard a card. Plus, there's a lot of problematic. Uh, theater horrors may come back. Little theater, little theater horrors. That's like a little shop of horrors, but different. What does Propane Command do again? Oh my god. Uh, okay. How many pips do we have? A good amount. How many what? Pips, pips for Gary. Pip 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 pips. Mm, Delta seems pretty bad. We have no way to get. Yeah, it's not fixing. It's just a swamp. No, you it's either mana confluence for me or the uh, Pia seems pretty decent. I also like the Sh Chandra. Yeah. You got nine seconds. Um, take the... Five seconds. Yeah. Four drop. It's like a... Michael. We get the leaving death, which I don't think we have a way to take advantage of. Otherwise, this pack is trash. So, uh... You're trash. I guess take the living death. 
Wait, why is it? Yeah, that's right. Wait. No, hit, that goes on the far right. There we go. Okay. We got some good ones here. Yeah, Opium Master's pretty fine, actually. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Like, Rob, one thing I think you weren't considering was how many four drops we already have, which is like Splinter Twin, Kalidus, um, Phoenix, Phoenix, Phoenix yeah. Muse. Actually, we have less than I thought, so maybe it's okay. Mutual. No, Robble. No, it's, I think it's fine. Rob, Take, it I, is. I like the theme. <laughs> I don't know if that was your final answer or if you're changing your mind or. You're looking between these two? Yeah. Okay. Uh, God, we got a lot of removal, right? Uh huh. Mm -hmm. All right, Savannah. <laughs> okay, please give me a real answer. We have six seconds. I was meaning Savannah, but I'll take the boat trader. It's fine. You wanted the theater? Yes, of course. Why wouldn't I? It's good card advantage against control decks. Take the red. When I said it earlier, you said it was all good. It's also a fire. He said that. Words. I never said that. I really want to take that lava claw. It's yeah. probably better than fiery. Uh. Fire is really good, though. You know what I like better than fire, actually, is casting, casting your spells. spells. Sure. Yeah. All right, take it. I think that's the correct pick. I don't think we need a fire confluence. The maggot returned. Yeah, I like having two drops. There are two playable cards, and you were going to really seriously pick Savannah? Yeah. Why would you do that? For the meme? But it's funny without, like, the meme itself is funny. You don't have to actually commit to, like, taking the Savannah. Lily. Lily. I love that card. Well, maybe we can play it now. It's a her. The card itself is an it. The card is not gendered. You said him. I said it. I said now we can maybe we can play it now. Clip it. Please clip it. It was a him. We can play him now. Who's Mike? Okay. Well. Oh, there's... Pretty much, Shriek Ma. I guess. No, oh, both of these cards are playable. You have five. You have six seconds. Five seconds. Thunder Ma, Thunder Break, whatever it's called. Thunder Ma. That's literally both of them. Is it me? Yeah. Oh, that's exciting. Gary, I'll take the crack. I bet you will. Put it in your crack. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'll put it in my crack. Okay. <laughs> Let's move all of it up here. Oof. All right, cards we're definitely playing. <laughs> like how you went to the expense of it. You're like, ah, uh, we'll start on the other side. <laughs> that's that's literally let's, just, let's just play well, it I'm here. like, let's get the small guys first. Uh, for sure playing the Hellkite? <laughs> it's good. I don't see why not. I mean, it's just a good card. It combos with Thunderball. How does it? We don't well, We don't have Thunderball, but how does it do that? Oh, I thought we took the Thunderball. But how does it combo with it? Oh, Thunder Break. Thunder Break, I was thinking of. Isn't it a dragon? Yeah, but how does that combo? Because it, it's other dragons. No, it's just Steel it's Hellkite synergy. gets plus one, plus oh. No, the, the effect from Thunder Break region. Whenever a dragon you could, Oh, that's oh, it. Hey. That I never knew. Maybe yeah, same with that then. and Hellkite. Oh, that's interesting. All the Hellkites. Look how many four drops we have. Jesus. No, oh, you didn't put them all on the deck. Oh, you didn't have to put them all on the deck. Well, you didn't have to put them all on the deck, little Billy Biscuits. Dude, you sound just out of like here. that. Really? I'd rather get uh, Toxic Deluge out of here. You don't okay. like Bone Shredder? He do, he, we've been over this, man. Doesn't kill enough things. Neither do you, you stupid Mitch. God, this deck has actually got a lot of playables. All right, you guys figure it out. That's it? Yeah, you might as well throw on the Hellkite. I like the Skargan Hellkite. Okay, well, there we go. <laughs> well, now we need eight cuts instead of seven, so that's good. Here's I your... think we can definitely cut Gravecrawler. Uh, Gravecrawler, yeah. Bone Shredder, yeah. Bloodgast, yeah. Do we really need the Exhume? Like, do we need the Reanimates here? We have other than Faithless. I don't Living. like. I don't even like the Reanimates here. Cut that. But Reanimate targets their dudes too. I would cut Exhume. Exhume's fine. I, I agree with that. Well, still. I just think it's not like how many decks are we facing where we're going to kill their guy and then have reanimate and then take like six damage to kill them like I think we're doing fine killing with our own creatures I just think we're aggressive enough where the reanimate damage won't matter too much get rid of the looting 
Well, if we're going to keep reanimated, I'd want to keep looting. Sure. Which I, I don't, I'm not sold on either of these. What four drop do we want to cut? We can cut the dragons and keep the Kiki combo with the conscripts, the Kiki Jiki, and Splinter. I would rather have Thunderbreak than P and Karen Alar. I'm okay with that. I only like P and Kieran because you can shoot stuff with it. Thunderbreak is just. Yeah, I guess I can see that. That's fine because we have other dragons too. Kieran. Right, that's what's yeah, that's what's kind of selling me. I'm like I'm, I like the Hellkites. Like I think just being able to attack for a, a billion in the if air. If that's the case, can we take out the the Kiki Jiki, the Splinter Twin, the Faceless Looting Reanimate, and that puts you at 23 cards for 17 lands? Why would we take out Kiki Jiki? Cut the Reanimate the Looting. I think I'm I think I'm okay with that. I mean, this is just a this just wins the game. Plus, like if you copy like a Masker Worm or something, or you copy yeah, like copy Gray Merchant. Time. If you copy P and Kieran Alar, if we left it in, like if we copy, I could actually see cutting Green Merchant then. Wait, why? <laughs> we have like Hypnotic Lily. We have Brain Maggot. Crit. I'm trying to figure out which five drops are the ones worth keeping. I mean, I I think this is probably I'd lean towards cutting this. Yeah, it's probably the weakest. Breaker, maybe? I could see it. I mean, you have to tap wow, two mana and it and discard a card just to make a 2-2. Two -two. But it draws um, cards, too. Yeah, only if you have three zombies out. We have, tap we have a lot of zombies. We have, like, two zombies left because we cut Gravecrawler. Uh, I mean, our zombies are literally just Grave War Muse and... Uh, and oh, Grave Merchant's a zombie, weirdly what enough. What is Brain Maggot? It's uh, Insect. insect okay. Oh, I disagree. Thunderbreak has not been weak in my experience. I mean, I feel like we're putting... We have a decent amount of pressure in this deck. Right, I agree. Pressure. I can see this is one cut. Do we want the Brain Maggot, then, if that's what we're trying to do? Well, yeah, because it's I mean, it eats a removal them. spell. Right, but it's not only that, but like, if they only have one removal spell, it takes it away, and then our threats are free to... Yeah, Lily and Khalid make zombies, but they're those are two dependent on this, this makes, actions. This doesn't make zombies unless another creature dies. Yeah, it's too dependent. On your side of the field, right? Yeah. Yes, one of your creatures dies. Non-token. I think we just cut this and this is good. Yeah. Plus, the more I've played against Spring Maggot, like, the better that card has been. Like, it just, it's just really obnoxious. Like, you don't want to waste your removal on it. Yeah, it's annoying. I guess so. 10, 9. Seems fine. Yeah. Done. I see. This is my first yeah. red, my my first red black deck that I've played. I'm glad I could be a part of it. Same. I can feel it. The only other time I played red back and black in a cube, I crushed. So hopefully it will repeat itself. Well, it's the only time I played red back. Red back. I'll keep this. We still have two drop, three drop, three drop. And we're on the play. I like this. Actually. Me too. <clears throat> Going Brain Maggot into Midnight Reaper is actually kind of interesting. Well, I'm going to play Hypnotic Spectre first. Would you? Yes, in no world am I playing a Brain Maggot. Or a, a Midnight. Why would I play, why would I play Midnight well, I mean, Reaper? It depends on what you see, because then you gain you gain a card from them. You essentially gain two cards. They're wasting a removal spell on the Brain Maggot, and you draw a card off of it. They have, like, nothing. Their hands pee. Yeah, we're just going to take this Conclave Tribunal. Yeah, I agree with that. Hippie's going to be stupid. Whoa, look at their land. Yeah, it's crazy. What the hell's going on? <laughs> so what do they have? One, two, three, four, five, six. So Jace and everything else. That's a jacked up hand of magic cards. So their hand is, what is that? Jace? Jace Fractured Identity. That's it. Overgrown Tomb, Verdant, Verdant Catacomb, Sacred Foundry, Taiga. Oh, there's they a Foundry. The Foundry. They have no blue in their hand, and they have two blue cards left. Yeah, this is this is where we can wreck them. I'm going to wreck them. I think they wrecked them. themselves. Check, 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 check. Can you turn your fan a little bit towards yourself? Towards me? Yeah, or, or towards Mike. Either one. Because it's literally, it was, it's blowing me literally right in the eyes, and I just catch myself. It's blowing me in the eyes. What did they play? They played Verdant Catacomb and Sacred Foundry. 
Oh, we can just play that too. Arnik has a surprising amount of card advantage. Ditch that fractured boop. Dang. Hey! I don't know, I thought that was one we didn't know. Midnight Reaper, keep on rolling. Well, hopefully they didn't top deck a wrath and another white source. No, they didn't. Well, they have to. They have to have both of those. Two out of the. Okay, one down. Sky chart. Nephilim. <laughs> now, what do they just excel the hypnotic specter? This is still okay. No, it's totally fine. I feel like they have three. We have six on board, so if they plus, it still dies. <laughs> we get to draw an extra card this turn. That's pretty good. So they're gonna fracture and guess next turn. Fracturing identity, you mean? Or fracturing identity. So we play the. Do we play Reaper here? I don't think we expose a Phoenix. Phoenix seems. Oh no, I'm an idiot. Why? Because Phoenix, they can't take advantage of. They'd have to. Yeah, it's still a four three. Yeah. True. And just because it doesn't return doesn't mean they don't have a good threat on the board. Fraction identity instant or sorcery? Sorcery. That'd be insane if it was an instant. Fuck, man. <laughs> These are all noises. Amazing. <laughs> Absolutely incredible. What do you mean? Uh, excuse me? We know they have Ogre in Tomb still. Okay, Dragon Skull Summon instead. Sounds good. What do you get rid of? My Graveborn Musei? Alright, now we just draw one of our removal spells and this game is over. I don't think the game is over necessarily. <laughs> oh, that's... It doesn't really do anything, right? How does that work? Uh, it's a current mana cost is still four, right? Yeah, so the three mana doesn't work, but I guess he, it's his own copy, so he would he would get it back. We can still attack for three, four, six, seven, eight. Put them to six. They take one. Put them to five. You just Phoenix here and pressure them, or maybe you attack with um, just Reaper. See if they block. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. And get a card from it. If they want to trade, that's fine. Because mm -hmm. then we can play Angrath with no pressure on the board and yeah, start. This is still good for us. Probably here. All right, so we know they have Jason, one of their cards. They don't have a second blue, apparently, or they did not until until now. I'm sure. Okay, three mana sounds good. Seems good. And we have lava claw reaches, so I'm pretty sure yeah. there's nothing they can do with yeah. this. Maggot kills it too. Right, but I'm saying even if they plus it, like we have oh, sure. lots of things that seems good. Okay. How big is Lava Claw? Is it a 2-2 two -two or a 3-2? And you it's, can pump a, it? it's a 2-2 two -two that you can pump. Oh, well, or, you know. Wow, we could do that and Phoenix. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I'm tempted to not use this though because we do have an answer to this one, two, three. Maybe, or we spend our entire turn and they have a removal spell and then they just get to take up their tap. I mean, one of their cards. Oh, they got rid of Jace. That's fascinating. It's just I like having like I like not having to use a removal spell. Yeah, because they can have a creature that we can use it on. Yeah, what, whatever. It's not like it's constructed. So what are the chances that they have? It's pretty high, I'm sure. <laughs> he did send you a smiley face.
Yeah, I think we're good here. Nice. <clears throat> Smile on me. Yeah, I like that better because now we just keep a devil in hand. Agree. Dude, look at all these lands this person took. It's crazy. It's crazy, dude. It's crazy. We haven't even seen one basic. It's thing. crazy. Ooh, he went to seven. He needs double blue. He's. We've seen ten lands. Not one is basic. Fascinating. Well, I guess they get their Angrath back. Or our, our Angrath. You got it. So we can attack him for five here if we wanted to, or thing in it. Yeah, we 100% put him to five. Or put him to two, I guess. Yeah. Oh, wait, we're putting no, him, put him to one. one. Yeah, that's pretty good. They have one card. They can't even do their quagmire. They can't even do their quagmire. Do the quagmire. Dun, dun, dun. Giggity. All right, so I have no cards in hand. Good to know. Breaking the Phoenix. So if they draw land here, they're dead. Not if it's a green land. Oh, a green land. Go ahead. Oh, that's good. <laughs> so now they're dead. <laughs> If they countered it, they would have had two blockers. Yeah. Fascinating. A bold choice. The heat is on. It's not, though. It's off. They turned it off. Hey, we win. The mic is on. Have any sinkholes? See, I feel like that was a matchup where Reanimate or Exhum would have been absolutely terrible. What creatures did we see from them? Brain Maggot? And... Galanandra. Yeah, Galen. that's pretty much it. I think we're good. Yeah, I think we're fine. My only thought was, was Skyboat. But... <sighs> They do a lot of planeswalkers. Yeah, I mean, that hits hard. Ugh. I could take Gary out for it. Gary just wins out of nowhere, though. Mm. I could take a Mask Worm out for it. Oh, uh, yeah, Mask Worm doesn't seem great here. Which is weird to say. We also have Bedevil and Never, which is pretty nice against planeswalkers. And it's always weird calling split cards by the half that you're, re you're re referring to. Oh, we could probably cut some of these as well. Oh, yeah, you're right. Oh, I didn't realize we were still playing Ultimate Prize. Well, price is better than blade here. True. Price is better than blade. Nice doom blade, nerd. Wow, that was mean. What? Me or him? You're a bully. What did he do? All he did was play a land. He looked at me. Wow. D did he? Yeah, I saw him in the mirror thing. Are you talking about Mike? Yeah. Oh, no, he's a dummy. Oh. Wow. Got him. S -s 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 Savage. <laughs> Michael, did you know that the heat was on? No, was, I thought the AC was on. It was cool in here. Yeah, I don't really... Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Michael, the heat... Oh, well, we lose. We don't lose. We win. Three lands? Deal. You better turn on the heat. He yeah. really milled three lands? And we have five in hand? Jesus. And we hit a fourth land right off the... That's crazy. Crazy! Shut up. We're never going to hit our second mountain. Shut up. Whenever... Oh, they hit Thunderbreaker and Brain Magot. B -b 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 Brain Magot. Brain Magot. All up in my brain, but God. What's wrong with you? Why are you being... I don't know, man. God, I want to hit their face to make them discard, but I want to hit Ashok because it's problematic. Can we just draw Bedevil or Never here? No? Okay. How, well, how does that... I'm just going to go face. Maybe. Mm. What do they have under it? Brain Maggot and... Thunderbreak Regent. Like, attacking it doesn't stop them from casting either. We can, so. Yeah, but we can kill the Thunderbreak Regent. 
So honestly, if they minus it, that's actually not bad for us. Oh, that's weak. Oh, they're, that's they're weak. They're one basic land in their whole deck. <laughs> it probably is the one basic in the whole deck, yeah. The heat is on. No, it's not. Oh, they're going to take our, our, our Thunderbreak Rajanto? This is really good for us. Is it? Yes, it is, because we're going to get a zombie. Oh my god, we can kill both of them. What's in your head? We can kill both yes. and then also kill this and yes. make them discard? Yes. Jesus. This is so good. That's insane. <laughs> Uh, doesn't matter which order we do, right? Just kill this guy. Yeah, whatever. <clears throat> Give me all the zombies, please. Oh, because it... Wait. If a non-token creature in opponent controls would die, why didn't we... Uh, Ashiok may have a clause that says something if it dies. No. It's a nightmare in addition to his type. Maybe because... Oh, because... No? No, it doesn't. That's not how Ashiok works. Cool. We got just out of a token. Program. No, you know what it was? It was because it was under his control. It doesn't matter. If a non-token creature in opponent controls would die, a non-token creature in opponent controls died. Yeah. Exile that card and create a 2-2. There's no, there's no trick you're missing. It just didn't work. Ashok and Cletus are bugged. Good to know. Good to know. Oracle is snot. Or are they drawing? They're drawing lava coil, which is, which kind? Of, wow, <laughs> we hit the Nahiri. Oh, gasoline. Well, they're gonna lava coil this guy, I'm sure. They're gonna go down to two cards and have to discard. Oh no, they're doing something Mollus? scarier. No, that's that's pretty bad. It's fine. I'm actually not super worried about it. Surprise. Oh, that's actually that's pretty good. Here. <laughs> now we get a lot of oh, you can eat their cards. entire hand. Yeah, it's nice. And play a Phyomancer so they can't attack. Ophio Mansa. What do you got? Show me what you got. Oh, the lava coil that we knew about. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> yeah, Ophio Mansa makes it hard for this Grave Titan to attack, and uh, we're not too too concerned with the Zomboys here. Those Zomboys are at it again. You got it. Take, Fair. take my boat. My sky boat no. We just basically hope we don't get wrecked by whatever's under shell. How? We're just gonna top tech a fulminator mage and kill it. <laughs> oh, that's sad. I has a sad. How big can you make your Cletus? Uh, it's five six. <laughs> Buddy, you don't got any floats. And you got no cards in hand. He's tempted to put his Glenlinger Archmage into play and block. Actually, Glenlinger is great against uh, Kalidus, so that's pretty cool. Here we go. Yeah. How is it good? How is it good? Yeah, how is it good against Kalidus? Uh, because it doesn't come back, it doesn't persist, it gets exiled. Oh, so, yeah, well, you mean Kalidus is good against Glenelundra. I was speaking from my perspective. Oh. <laughs> oh, uh, oh. I thought you guys would be more impressed that I named it, and I knew the exact card they had. Every time there. I used to joke about Calder Bucks, you told me I was a stupid idiot. <laughs> I was. I told you we were a stupid idiot for joking and trying to make people pay for your, for my call dits. Well, well, opponent has regret. And you can sack one of your zombos. I'd be more impressed if you didn't do it every time. So I'm just so used to it that it's just like, eh, that's fair. Of course you knew. Are you sucking up? I don't think it's sucking up when it's like literal. It does it's happen pretty, all the time. It's pretty insane. Huh. Pretty insane. What? Are you ready for them wings, boy? Fuck. This is an 
This is an alpha. This is an interesting attack here. I have no idea if this is scoop. I don't know what's going this is on. Such a bad attack. It doesn't seem good. They have to have a wrath. Yeah, maybe the drew wrath. That's the only thing that would make sense. It's here. the only thing I could even imagine. And they have the quag and fumes. Yep. Okay, sure. I was just impressed that you guys didn't say anything that I called it. So we lost a Pia, an Ophiomancer, and a Kalidus. They lost the Supreme Verdict, a Grave Titan. Shouldn't we have gotten... No. Yeah, we drew something that can... Grow uh, our boat. I think it's boat, yeah. Can you play the boat first? And then smack him for sace. I mean, I hate wasting the the trigger, but... I, I think you're right, though. They all see each other die. Right, but no, Grave Titan died before before the Supreme Verdict. It was dead from the, the token. Oh, so yeah. that's how we punted. We could have had a tutu. No, I don't think that's a punt. I think you want to kill the Grave Titan. Oh, no, that wouldn't have worked either way because we would have gotten the 2-2 and the Supreme Verdict would have killed the 2-2. So it was irrelevant. No, if you let the Supreme Verdict be the one to kill it, then you get the token. Ah, uh, correct, yes. What's our opponent's name? Uh, Dusel ben Benefrior. Okay. I can, <laughs> yeah, it's a pretty I common get, name. I can get with that. And I can oh. get with this, or I can get with that. This is good for us. This, uh, yeah, this basically says I have nothing, so that's good. That's nice. If by I have nothing, you mean Vindicate. That's a sorcery, so I'm not really too concerned with it. Vindicate? Yes, Vindicate is a sorcery. Also not a bad draw. Oh. Well, I can't do both, but I'm more concerned with just killing them. Yeah. What? Do you disagree? No, no. I was thinking in my head that we're going to draw one more card because we have one more turn, and it's going to be a land. Vindicate. Oh, we get to draw a card. Oh, 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 oh God! No. Son of a biscuit, man. There was a land on top. That sucks. That's really frustrating. I don't know what just happened. I could have played the land and play Obnixilus, but I have six because I was. Oh, okay. Wow, this is turning on to. This is turning into a hot mess. Oh my god. It's a hot mess. In the city. Hot mess in the city. Alright, what can we hit here? A three drop. That's it's not bad. It's not, it's not bad. We lose the race though, right? One, two, three, activate. One, two, three. Yeah, they, they just attack with both. Maybe. They so, have no cards, so I'm pretty sure they're just attacking with both. And then killing our... Our boy. I can count six damage. Oh, we also lose a life, too, because of the card draw. That's relevant, because we're at, they have six. So how is that relevant? What are you talking about? Because they're, kill they're, gonna, they're killing Omnixilus. Oh, okay. Well, that's actually good for us. <laughs> like I was like, what are you talking about? Sorceries are cool. That's really obnoxious. Like, what's the point of playing? I guess that just saves us an extra million life again. We could also just play Kiki Jiki and attack. Yeah, I like that actually. Don't we gain life on the back half of um, Never? No. <laughs> Goes a good guess though. Just exile a card from Graveyard. Make it 2-2 two, two Zomboid. Seems good. Mm. That's really fucking nice reveals there. Jesus Christ. Okay, take it easy, man. It's a family-friendly stream, buddy. Well, it's not family-friendly, but, like, it's not... It's not late-night stream, either. Like, they can cast this... They only have one blue. I can kill... I think we just give them the Mystic Confluence and, like, Angrath. No, Kior is better. Yeah, that seems fine. Uh, they took... Yeah, they took Confluence and Kiora. 
So probably playing Kiora, like you like you do. Yep, target that guy. And now we're just gonna draw Zealous Conscripts and kill them. Oh, that's interesting. So five, six, seven, eight, four. We can actually kill both of them, which is pretty sweet. Yeah, because it makes a copy, right? Oh. Actually, what? Are you okay? I was counting our mana. We're one mana short from being able to kill them with the Grade One Muse. Like, like you mean kill them? Kill them? Yes, like death six to six to the face. We're one mana short. How? You could minus the Angrath on the Graveborn oh, no, Muse, and then copy the Graveborn Muse. That's six damage. Oh, I see what you're saying. I think you just kill the Kiora. We can kill both. Oh yeah, that's I. I actually think you leave the Jace. Why would I leave either? Well, because the Jace is gonna is it, it's a neg three, right? Jace is neg three. Why would we leave them a Jace? I'm not gonna leave them. No, it's neg two. Okay, so they can neg again. Because Angrath kills them in two pluses. That was my. A thought. lot of things in our deck kill them in two pluses. Killing Kiora. Kiora, Kiora, oh my god, when you knock like that, you make Kiora go mad. Kiora go mad? Is that a famous version? Yes, that's Kiora go mad. No, they have Mystic Confluence again. There's no way I'm letting them keep it, Jace. Confluence lets them return creatures or counter spells. Bounce right? creatures, counter spells, or draw cards. Okay. Okay, so let's draw an extra card here. Oh, that's a good one. So six, seven, eight, nine. We play this for five. They have to use two modes on 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 this guy. If we go to do this, then they might just bounce it. We can always respond, right? With what? Like if we play the Angrath and they go to bounce, then we can respond. Yeah, he's saying play the Angrath first. I'm saying if I play Angrath, it gives them something to counter, whereas if they want to bounce this. Oh, yeah, sure. That's also lethal, so. We need to find a way to land Thunder Rape Regent with our Cold Against command, and then we're just. I mean, we have two creatures here. If they want to go bounce, bounce, draw, that's fine. But I want to, I want to like, playing this in a situation where they can't actually counter it is nice. Probably going to Quagmire the normal one, bounce one. I'm going to, I might just Cold Against command that. I think, yeah, one hundred percent. Because they're let them they're, let them cast their spell. They're gonna do it before damage. I, no, I'd move to damage, make force them to do the spell. I don't think they're taking three here. You think they're gonna take three? Yeah. Why wouldn't they? All right. My my thought right, was go to go. Yeah, we'll go to blocks then. Sure. There you go. They're blocking. Okay. Well, I assume they were gonna block. Right, but okay. So they took three. This is kind of the bait here. Uh, discarding doesn't do anything, right? <clears throat> discarding forces them to cast their Confluence right now, and then you can cast the Angrath. They have one card in hand. Let's return a creature from the graveyard. All right, let's. But they're just going to counter it. Let's get back. Probably Thunderbreak, right? Because if Thunderbreak lands, then they're trapped under the Thunderbreak. They have to chump block it. So they have to use all three modes on this? I guess they could use two and we could just pay for it. There's a lot of options here. Is this game one? Or is this match one? Good lord. We 
Wait, counter trigger spell unless it's control phase three and then draw two cards? I'm just going to pay three here then. Or not. No, um, I, I think you cast put them to one and then they have to answer both. They have one, uh, well, I guess they're drawing a card, but still, I think it's. Let's get angry up here. And then this goes to five, so it doesn't lose to Fumarole and they don't have. Quag. Yeah. Uh, they have spires, but then they're dead to the Kiki Jiki. Right, like they can't, they can't. Well, they can't activate both because they cost four each. So one, two, three, four, yeah, five. One, right. two, three, four. If they play a land, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then they have to tap every single land. So. Yeah. Then the only yeah no then that's just we win the game. Oh. That was a hell of a game. Well, we're not done yet. We're not done yet. They're at one. We have two onboard Death Boys. We can also exile a thing. Two onboard death boys. That's what I always say. Can Kiki copy tokens? I think it's no. It's yeah. It's, you not, can, it's not legendary. Yeah. It doesn't. Yeah. It doesn't care. He don't care. Kiki don't give it. Don't gaf. Gaff. He don't even gaff. You remember that time when we saw Jim Gaffigan? I do. That was cute. That you you do? That. Yeah, I was there. You being serious? You don't remember me being there? That's kind of messed up. <laughs> Were you there with us? Yes. Yeah, yeah, I was there. Yeah, you bought his ticket. Well, yeah. This is really weird. I thought it was me, you, and Astrid, dude. No, it was all four of us. Yeah, it was all four of us. At Amway Arena. That's a yikes for me. <laughs> wow, I feel like a, I feel really weird right now. I feel like, wow, that's super strange. All right, bro. I don't know, man. He must live in an alternate timeline. Or maybe he just doesn't remember it. You're probably right. Who? Which one? Him. Is it time to is it time for me to go to my next match? Right 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 click. Right. Click. I'm right clicking. No, no, opponent. You should tell him. Maybe oh. he doesn't know. <sighs> strawberries and salads I think in certain salads strawberries could be good with like a like a vinaigrette or something I have some bad car news spent 1500 on a new car and it has some issues the seller is like to tell me getting scanned oh that seems terrible oh man the engine ticks and vibrates after driving it for a while while the engine is hot when the engine is hot turns out the whirls of death is a problem for that model Ugh. what have you what have you done to fix it what have you done lately? What What have you done to try and get rid of the tick? Because generally, ticking is a symptom. Can be a symptom. Obviously, it okay. can be detonation, which is bad. But detonation? Also, yeah, it's called detonation. Like a like a like a time bomb? Essentially, but it's called detonation. That's what. Detonation is what happens when a time bomb goes it's off. It's also what happens when your air to fuel ratios are off. But the um, ticking is also a symptom of. Um, what happened here? Uh, he fractured identity our Angrath. Still over. Wait, why didn't they? S no, I guess that doesn't do anything. Oh. <laughs> Copy it in response to the trigger. <laughs> but the problem is if they have any removal spell. Well, no, the trigger still goes off. Yeah. No, if they have a removal spell for this while oh, the trigger response. is on the stack. Yeah, that would have been bad. Yeah, yeah we're, we're, it's pretty bad. Well, they had zero cards. Oh, that's good to know then. Poggers. All right, let's keep let's finish this off because I want to go eat some food before my head explodes. This deck was pretty strong. It's literally the first round. We could go two one two. You yelled at me earlier for being so negative. Now I'm being positive, and you're yelling at me. What do you want from me, man? Just, I'm doing my best. I want to keep you on your toes. Jesus. Oh, by the way, anyways, what I was getting to is uh, ticking can be a symptom of low oil. So check your oil level. It, it actually could be something that simple. Got him. Did you get him? I got him. Ticking could be a symptom of low oil. Check your oil. 
so it doesn't detonate. How you doing back there, buddy? He's asleep. He's always asleep. I'm used to it by now. Welcome back. Do you keep this? Uh, no, I, I think you have better better hands. What do you think? Hey, wake up. I'm thinking right now, you son of a bitches. Don't hurt yourself. Okay, take it easy. Don't hurt yourself. I'm in a chat with this will be right now. That game was that game was great. Uh, what's I'm, it's so close? How is it close? We have no castable spells. But we'll get there. <laughs> Ready? Swamp ums. Swamp them if you got them. That's what I always say. <laughs> if we have one swamp, we have a million swamps. You understand? Swamp. Ramp. Playing mono red. Swamp. Yep, playing mono red. Mono red swamp. That's, That's a white card. Disqualified. Illegal! I think we messed up with this keep, guys. I'm going to be honest with you. I hope I don't die tonight. I hope my... I hope my... My beef hole... Your beef hole? My beef hole doesn't hurt so bad that I can't... I hope your hole. beef hole doesn't hurt either. Beef hole. Put it in my beef hole. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Okay, I was going to I was gonna go to the end step, and then I was like, oh, we're going to have to discard, so I might as well kill this. Now, during my Monfazio. Why didn't you wait till their turn? Because we would have had to discard. I literally said, I literally explained why I didn't wait till their turn to do it. That's weird. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, you're awake for that one? <laughs> He's exhausting sometimes. Yeah, it's sad, but... Oh, look, look at this. What is our opponent playing? I think they might not be mono-red. I'm starting to think they're not mono-red. Let's see it. Oh, they're white, boys. <laughs> oh, we got some white going on, boys. No, not the chicken. Yes, the chicken. Expose the chicken. What if he draws a white and then conclaves it? I don't even think that card's in the format, dude. Oh, no. It is in the format. We're halfway there. We literally just... They literally played it against us last round. I know. We've literally had conclave played against us like every round. Oh, I see what you're saying right now. I see what you're saying right from now. Come on, Robert. Do your job, Robert Nixilis. <laughs> Dead. Burn it. I want it burned to the ground. This What's up? What's up, gang? Gang? Who are you talking to, Roberto? The same person that said, What's up, gang? So I said it back. Say it to my face. Gang? Okay, stop it. I'm, 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 I feel attacked right now. Sorry. That's, I forgive you. This is your, this is your great defense. They know this house flying, right? What the? <laughs> that was a weird choice, that man. Is... <laughs> that is a thing. That is a thing that you could do, I guess. I have no idea what that, that was. That was so weird. All right, I'm just going to kill him. See you later. <laughs> Maybe they really wanted to preserve their life total. I guess. They, wouldn't they have done that by me attacking Karn anyway? Is it Himpia or is it Angrath? It's just Angrath. We're not getting multiple Planeswalkers on the board, my dude. Have you seen the Angrath animation on Arena? Maybe he's got his little his little axe thing. He it flings and my it. axe. That's what it does. Hmm. Huh. Huh. Uh oh. They knew what was happening. I mean, this is gonna deal two, right? So they yeah. both survive. <laughs> Maybe they had two main artifact. They don't. We made them discard history banale. Oh, they chose to discard history banale. Yeah, that was not a... Interesting. Alright, Angrath. Angrath it is. Can I steal your Silverblade Paladin and just... Doesn't it die? So Wait. they're, they're done on board. Alright, let me figure He's, it out. Yeah, okay. Let me figure it out, Roberto. I think you're... I think you're thinking something works differently. Yeah, I am. I am thinking something. You're thinking we steal this in double strike. Uh, how many lanes do we have? No, well, they're still dead on board. It still has double they're strike right? when board. you steal it. Yeah, but it's the heat. But that's so only four, eight damage. Five, six, seven, eight. They're still dead on board. No, we. 
You can you can steal their silver blade, uh -huh. splinter twin it, make a copy of silver blade, mm -hmm. pair it with their kindling phoenix, and you can either minus the ob to kill the Kari Zev, or you can hit it with never, and the game's over. Four plus four, plus four, four. four plus floor. <laughs> now let me see if I can figure this out. He can cop he can target himself, right? What target who target himself? Splinter Twin can he can target himself, correct? What is that, what does that mean, target himself? I'm just making sure Splinter Twin he can you can enchant his silver blade and target itself. <laughs> target himself? Who's he targeting? Splinter Twin only makes a copy of the creature that it's on. I it never, doesn't I never played the card, so I I'm just it doesn't, sure. Yeah, but I didn't understand your question because it doesn't make sense for in the context of the card. You're asking if it can target itself. It's not like Kiki Jiki where you're targeting something else. Splinter Twin makes a copy of the so card it is on. you didn't understand what I was saying because of the actual re words of the card? Because the word of... No, the, the question you were asking doesn't make sense. Because of the way the card's worded, correct? Right. Okay, so, yeah, I get that. But now you're getting on me because I didn't know the wording of the card. I'm not getting on you. I'm explaining... You got a little hostile. A little hostile. I hate you. A little hostile. I hate you. I think we're just going to submit like this. I think our deck is actually pretty good. Get off bone, of her bone, bone shredder, maybe. Uh, early game removal, because they're going to be some sort of aggro. That'd they're going to be fun. some sort of aggro. I don't care. Do, 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 do. we are got a bedevil and a cold guns coming. Do, 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 do. As long as we draw them out in this can, it's pretty insane. Who cares about a 1 2? Wow, you can cold guns command both of those. I don't think Good. I'm going to, but I can, I can appreciate your excitement. <laughs> can y'all have a beard off? Come on, Tom. Get it together. That's a straight L for me, dog. Straight L? Yeah. I can't compete with yours. Why? Because yours is a lot more fuller. Yours is also... Well, how did yours get when it's long? When's the last time you had it long? I shave regularly, so I've done... But I mean, I... like, years ago, you never had it long? No, because no? that looks because I look like a scruff lord. Do, do your hairs get curly? Because they look really straight. Pretty sure everyone's hairs get curly. No. Some, pe some, pe some people's beard hair comes down straight. Name them. Give me a list of them. Uh, Frederick. I, oh, Frederick. The, the yeah, that's Franken twin. <laughs> oh, Masa that's Ma Masakre Worm Wormerson. Masakre Wormerson. <laughs> Pascal Minardo always calls it Masakre, and I'm like, that's not that's not how that's pronounced. Sp Splinter Splint Tom. Splinter Tom. There's nothing wrong with this Gruff Lord. It's just not for me. I prefer a more well groomed appearance. Splinter Tom. Wow, well-groomed appearance. Get fucked, Robert. Get fucked. <laughs> Jesus Christ. That was so passive-aggressive. It wasn't. Yes, it fucking was. Okay, take it easy, my Jesus. dude. Take it easy, my dude. I, uh, I, no, I, there's nothing wrong with it. I just I just prefer to look better. I just I prefer... Oh, no. <laughs> oh, this is bad. I need a Toxic Daily stat. We don't... Are we, didn't we take that out of the deck? Yep. Well, we didn't put it in the deck, so... This is a lot more aggressive than our last roll. I agree with you. I am having a bad time. How do we navigate this? You have to kill something with the poorly. Command. I think we kill this guy before it can untap. Yeah, I agree with that. Why don't they have any artifacts right now? <laughs> Make them discard, but yeah. I don't like it. No, sir, I don't like it. Oh god, I'm gonna vomit. So they're taking fourteen, but we gain two. So we got a, we got so a six. We take twelve. Yikes. Yeah. Oh, good, because I made the disc. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. What happened? Oh, Bobby biscuits. And our Massacre Run, the best, the worst part is like Massacre Run doesn't even do anything against these guys because the stupid locks it on. I'm going to chump block instead of going to one. I don't think we have a card in our deck that actually stops nope. this. All right, we are going to board in Toxic Deluge for sure. I think we board in all the removal that we have. Okay, Boney and Toxie. Uh, maybe take out Chicken to China, the Chinese Chicken. Got the drumstick. <laughs> Brain starts ticking. Watching X Files with the lights on. Stuff like that. Kiki Jiki Splinter Twin out. I don't see why. Five and I what about Angrath? 
He steals and kills a creature. Yeah, that's true, I guess. What did you take out? It's actually a removal spell. I, mean, I took out Kiki Jiki. I'm going to leave in Splinter Twin because I still think it's fine. You got you have 41 cards. I, oh, no. All right. Heavens, no. Heavens, Brain defense. Maggot, maybe? Mm, Brain takes a thing. Maggot. It's a two drop, takes a thing and blocks. I think it's fine. Takes a thing and dies, you mean? Yeah. Okay, so what? Whatever. This, this hand's good. Yeah, this hand's very good. Put a lid on it. I think Frank's brain stopped ticking. Wow, that's rude. That's rude. It's probably low on oil. Could be detonating. Oh, Robert, who cares about this? Nobody. It was so good. It was terrible. No. No. My name is Rob. Living Death actually wasn't that bad of a card to play. I was thinking about that, but like it's. It can be a little scary sometimes. Mm. I'm sorry, what? Um, nothing, dude. Are you okay? I'm fine now. I need you to relax. The Goofy movie's good. I liked it. The Goofy movie is good. Rob liked it. Tom, how old, how old is your daughter? 70. 71 this year. Pullman, if you want one. My wife makes them. Ha! God, Kalidus is gas. Oh, and then he comes to play tap. That sucks. No, I'm just going to kill it. I'm going to, 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 I'm going to. Why not play the Kalidus first, then? I was, I was going to. I'm going to go play oh, this. Oh, you took the Kabu. That's sick. <laughs> it's actually real good, especially yeah, when we're dropping a Kalidus. Oh, too. That's awesome. You watch Princess Sophia? Or Sophia the First? I don't know who you're talking to. I'm talking to Tom. We had a conversation going on. No, I'll, I'll stay out of it then. No, no. It's shame. Are you kidding me? It's shame from... From whatchamacallit. What's the show I was always asking you about? Shameless. No. Uh, sh Game of Thrones. It's from Game of Thrones. Did he really not know? I thought he was just trying. No, he was I just couldn't doing remember it. It was, it was. I thought he was just doing a little meme there. Oh, that's gas. Yeah, they're just dead. Yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah, they're dead. I want to kill this. You did. I want to kill this too. No, make him do it in combat. Make it? I don't want him. No, because I'm going to mistakenly do it. What? Whatever, it doesn't matter, Michael. Robert, Michael Robert. <clears throat> Michael Robert <laughs> the third. It's a Westworld thing, you guys wouldn't understand. Oh, wow, really? Take that. And Ingraph incoming. It feels Ingraph. I hope they play a Brimaz. Oh, so we can steal it, get a, get a token, <laughs> and, and kill, kill it. it. <laughs> oh, it's dark. Oh, that's, that's pretty have, close. We have Bedevil, and I, don't, I, don't, I don't really care. I'm not, I ain't scared. Attacky, tacky. Welcome. Oh, they just, they're dead. Come back. They're like, I'm out. Aren't you a big fan? No, they weren't a fan. I just want to. Go to the go to the next game. Our deck is good. Ooh, Doc McStuffins is great. Doc McStuffins. Doc McStuffins. <laughs> Maybe one day you guys will have kids and you'll understand. Yeah, I'm good. No? No little Frankies? <sighs> oh boy. Baby Frankums. Are we going to get the trophy on the three-person draft? So far, the two trophies I've won would be in red decks, if this is if this is accurate. Uh, well, we knew right away we were in a cloth, cloth deck, so. Oh, I didn't mean to mulligan, but it's okay. I think it's all right. I think it's okay. Oh, I didn't want to mulligan that hand. It was looking pretty good. I think this hand uh, might be, yeah, it's close. If there's a mountain on top of my then. 
Uh, oh, better. That's like a mountain. I missed it. What was it? Frank's head was in the way. Oh. A scully don't tell boy. him. Dang it. Stony boy? A scully boy. Skull boy. I don't, oh, it was Dragon Skull Summit. 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 How many times have you drafted uh, Torrential Gearhawk? Swell D2. In this format. None. Zero. You, you literally haven't drafted once? No, because it's not. I don't think it's that good in this in this format. Like you That's just, what I'm asking. I was going to ask. Oh, wow. Bird, Avenger, or Time Spiral? I'm just taking the bird here. Yeah. Although... We don't care about Time Warp. Yeah, you're right. So they have three cards. They have Bird, Avenger, and they have Avenger, Time Warp, and Island. Okay. Did they mulligan? Yeah, we both went to six. Okay. And I could just kill Avenger with a, this on the stack, with the ability on the stack. I mean, he's also got to get the seven mana, so. No beats. I'm mine are um, gonna be eight, and my daughter's nine, so I'm past those stages. My my son just got past Ninjago when the movie came out. We watched it. It was pretty good. Ninjago. Hey, Ninjago. Hot take. The world needs another little Frankie or two. Is it a hot take? That's what they said, not me. Hmm. Seems like a cool take, daddy -o. <laughs> Listen to the sounds of my voice. Hey, daddy -o, that is one cool take. Hey, papa. Uh-oh. <laughs> Bless you. Thank you. Oh, interesting. Fascinating. That's not bad. Well... Well, they have enough to play it next Seven. turn. So the next next turn, we got to keep up the. Uh, but they can't. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, they have seven. So if they have a land, correct? Which they do. We know they have a land. Yeah. yeah. If I mean, if I could draw lands, that'd be cool. Because um, I missed a land drop, but I guess we're just gonna pass here. So they get a token for each one of their lands, right? And then whenever a land ETVs. Yeah. Then they get they pump it. That card's stupid in commander. It's it's pretty dumb in all formats, really. Except the ones where it's not played. Like in those formats, it's probably pretty bad, yeah. yeah. So we know they have Time Warp and nothing else. <laughs> oh, boy. I mean, that's good if we ever... Our hand is insane if we hit, like, we have... Lands, yeah. Like, Graveworm Muse is just great next turn. We just gotta hit one more land. That'll get us there. Here is my snake. Don't touch my snake. <laughs> The old hit. Don't touch my snake. A classic. Merchant trains for eight if you can get all your bees on the field. Actually, it drains for ten now. That's a good one. So you're going to activate, time warp, activate. Time warp. <gasps> they do not have that many time warps, Robert. Like when I call you Robert? Uh, I love it. Thanks. Are you guys hungry? Yeah, I've been mm -hmm. hungry for a while. You want to go eat after this? I would love to. You want to eat some wings that'll come out of your... No, I just want to have a regular meal like a, an adult. Do you want to try it, though? I would probably try some, okay. sure. All right. I'm excited for that. I'll be like, give me one bone, boneless wing with it on there. Hey, if it's like too hot for you, are you the kind of person that Please. Wait, where the babies out and just quits? Oh, they no, cast. No, I'm time. not quitting, boy. He'll quit. He's a little bee. You don't even know. He's a little baby bee. Bring it home, my baby. Bee. Oh, that was a good hit. We got the land. We got the land. How many pips we got, man? One, two, three, four. I guess. It's I guess it's not worth it yet. Well, let's, we also have four mana, so it's not really an option. <laughs> oh, right. It costs five. <laughs> well, we'll have six, seven, eight, right? It, it, it cacks for eight, so they're dead next turn with a hit from Hippie. So we go to the face. They have no cards. We'll attack Nissa with this guy. Doesn't matter. No, I'd rather keep it on defense for their land. Who cares? We're at 15. And we're also going to play Greyborn Muse, which is a 3-3. So. Yeah, so if we hit land next turn, we deal him 8. And they should be dead from the hippie attack. 
Yeah, if I can just eat guys every turn, it's totally fine. I wish we could bounce something. I love I love bouncing something and then connecting with Hypnotic Spectre. That's my favorite. That's my fave. Also, we get to hit two cards, so odds are good. The odds are ever in our favor, and we they we know everything. We have perfect info now because we know Pilgrim's on top, and they have Garrick in hand. So basically, we just get to untap, and as long as one of our cards is land, we get to deal one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight damage and attack them with a hippie to death. To death! This game's over. No blocks. I'll take eight and go to seven. Is this game two or one? This is game one. Okay. Oh, it's Gary. Are you okay? Yeah. You make weird noises sometimes. Thanks, dude. <laughs> Gary! The, the GG after one game is awkward for me. I'm like, I'll say it, but I don't like it. This is definitely a Toxic Deluge deck as well. Oh boy. And a Bone Shredder deck. Yep. And a Mask Worm deck. Masakre Worm, if you will. They have no way to deal with Brain Maggot, which is so, always nice. I'll take out Kikim Jikims. What about? Oh. Uh, I guess it's a flyer. As I say, what about Thunderbreak? Because really, I kind of like I kind of like Sky Sovereign Sky here as well. Seems pretty good too. Maybe not on the draw. I mean, it still shoots something as soon as it comes down. It kills Planeswalkers, and we saw two of them, which I think is really relevant. I don't think you need Thunderbreak here. I can see that. Everything else seems fine though. Yeah. 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 Where's Dignom? I told you to bring Dignom. What does that mean? <laughs> I was thinking Steel Hellkite. Steel Hellkite is definitely uh, an option. <clears throat> <clears throat> We've yet to combo kill someone. Let's do that. I want to combo kill you. I want to end your life with my combo kills. All right, well, we're just going to hope we draw. Swampums, I guess. Swampum McMompums. What was our seven? Uh, like one land and six spells. Swole Mike, honesty stream. Do you like gladiator movies? Have you ever been to a Turkish prison? Uh, the movie Gladiator or just gladiator movies? Gladiator movies. It's literally spelled out here. Um, I don't care for those movies. <laughs> Typical. But I have not been to a Turkish prison. False. It's honesty stream, not liar stream, Mike Robert. That was a good draw. You're welcome. I for what? I was it was me. I think I can remand it? Oh boy. Oh boy. Now we're gonna take the card that they just drew. <laughs> thank you. Guy that plays bass, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. I really appreciate it. <clears throat> you are a kind soul. Oh boy. Oh, that's a good one. Do I want a bone shredder this Nissan? No, I want to just bring maggot here. I want to make sure they don't have a four-mana Planeswalker. And they definitely do. Uh, deep Analysis, they don't care about. Good lord. Carnage Tyrant, too. That's super awkward. It's got to be Garrick. It does have to be Garrick, which is super awkward. Because you can hope... Then they're going to go Beast Whisperer, and then you can play your Bone Shredder if you don't hit your double black. Well, I bet they probably actually go uh, Deep Analysis to hit... A land drop for the next turn. One, two, I three, see. four. So they have one, two, three, four, five. Forest is the. Yeah, but they could do that either way, right? Well, they could do it on turn five, but that means they don't play Nissa on turn five. So. Oh, they played the forest. I would rather play Deep Analysis on four to, to make sure I can play Nissa on five. Yeah, exactly. All right. Well, I mean, I think it's worth killing. We have nothing else to do. Yeah, which is awkward. Our problem is going to be dealing with the Carnage Tyrant. No, we'll just steal it. Uh... It's 
Fire sponsor. Do they not have a land? Sorry, play a forest. Not this turn, they didn't. The one in your thing. Mm. Last turn, they played forest. Yeah, they played forest. They played right. D-Vanal. That was just... Wow. Well, you know. <laughs> sure. Jesus. Really? You know, just one mill slam carnage turn? I guess you can play Beast Whisper here, too. I would like a land that's a swamp. Can you? This guy's dead. Never, never happening. Nope. That's not a land, that's a swamp. Mm, I guess we'll play it and lose two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine mana. Hmm. No beach, you're right. I, I'm assuming he knew that. Yeah, it was a joke. Okay. Because Carnage, it wouldn't deal with it anyway. It just steals it for one turn. That's why I made that long, awkward. Right. Like, I thought you knew I was joking. Well, when yeah, you I knew, I knew, I knew you were joking. Well, I assumed you were, but then when he did that noise, I thought that you, like, in the past, he had told you to target it, and you were making a joke towards him because you were looking at him. when you. It's a huge, it. like, I've seen the plot. I've unraveled it in my mind. I was trying to find Pepe Silvia. Oh boy. Oh good, a primary Scoop. titan. Did you just say scoop? Mm hmm How dare you talk to me like that? Yeah, it's gonna be a scoop from me, dog. Is it? Yeah. God, the green decks and the red decks are the most powerful decks in the cube. Because they're just so proactive, it's really hard to keep up with. What if I steal this mother trucker? Are we in a situation where we can win if we just like Angrath steal your primeval titan? How much life can we deal? We don't deal life, you deal damage. One, two. Three. I think it's worth a shot. I think we're winning this game any other way. And they got a Thraggy boy on the top though. That's pretty. That's pretty frustrating. Uh, attack your face, attack your face, attack your face. Well, we have four damage from the from the cop thopters. The cop thopters. Lava claw and dragon skull seems like the best options. Oh man! They just took it. Yeah. Fascinating. Vivian Reed. So we could deal five with Gary. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, it's not enough. Four. Mm. Technically, you have. Well, I mean, they can't even alpha. Well, they can just attack with prime time at the Angrath, which is what we want. Actually, I don't want them to. I want them to attack my face with prime time, right? Don't I? Well, no, because I think we're going to get clocked here, is our problem. Clocked? What does that mean? They're, because of the trample damage. I'm saying I think I don't think we have a way to keep up between the Carnage Tyrant coming down and the Prime well, Tyrant. Well, doesn't have haste. Right, but exactly. So if they attack our face right now, what are you going to block? We're not going to block with anything, right? Right. So we take, what do we take? Six, go to 12, and then they have 13 trample damage coming next turn. And then Gary's got a big old butt. I don't know. I, I'm not going to worry about it until I know what they're doing. Like, yeah. This is basically they're going to lose, though. We need, yeah, we need a, we need a land here. So if we oh, they took two from Ancient Tomb. Oh, but they're gaining five from Thrag Tusk. Never yeah. mind. That's actually good for us though, because it kind of balances out the, the five life from the Thrag Tusk. Well, they gain three instead, and it's still not legal on the board. However, yep, this guy just kills Angrath. Yeah, plus they gain two there. There's just a lot going on. Oh, yeah, they get the lands from the Corsair. Ugh. So yeah. Apparently they're also playing white for something. Don't know what. I mean, they could just be playing this as a land that draws them a card. Well, you know, they got this too, I guess. Here comes Connor Tyrant. What about Toxic Deluge for, like, 
six here. That'd be Toxic insane. Deluge is exactly what we need. I forgot we had that in our deck. It was a swamp. So I think you have the Hippie and Never. One of the damage sources. Attack for two in the air. That puts him to ten. You still have six cards in hand, dude. That's insane. <laughs> yeah. These two are... The, the incremental advantage from these guys is really high. Hard to keep up with, yeah. I mean, I think you have to kill Primetime because they're gaining life, for sure. What's the undo button on Moto? Uh, Control Z. Just oh, like okay. Your, so normal yeah, undo. normal undo. Oh, interesting. So we have four on board next turn. Puts him to six, and then Gary... Can Gary and sacrifice one token. It's, it's definitely an option, but they're going to gain one life at least. So that's not really as much of an option. Actually, we can deal 11. 11 damage. Yep, I was literally just thinking that. We can do literally 11 damage right now, and they haven't played land Well, yet. they're probably going to kill our Hypnotic Spectre now. Yep. Yep. Damn it. It's just ridiculous. They're dirtling so much, though, with the amount of power they have that they're actually giving us a chance is what's ridiculous. The fact that we're at 18 right now. Vivian Reed. Yeah, I'm just going to end the game. Like, they, they get to kill Brain Maggot, then play Garrick. It's just like, whatever. All right, let's get this win. We're on the play now. I think I think the way we are is fine. I yeah, think I'd rather I, have this than Splinter Twin, maybe. I actually don't mind getting the combo back in the deck on the play. Well, I mean, we have Splinter Twin and Zell's Conscripts. Yeah. So it's still, like, part, okay. part way there. Is K-Command worth it? Three mana kill a dork? Yeah, for sure. That's definitely really good, yeah. Also, get back your guy, make them discard. Like, yeah, I don't think K-Command's ever not worth it. Okay. Are we at 40 right now? I think we're good right now. Yeah, this is fine. I think the key is if we have two removal spells and a creature is what we need in our opener, or our first eight or nine. <sighs> yes, in the third this, time. This keeps happening. We're yeah, double mounds. Stupid. I don't think you, you can't keep that. Just that's stupid. Still not the worst there. All right. Mountain Muffet's Ur. Oh, I'm just. Uh, on top. I'm yeah, I would keep that. Probably just keeping that. It's too good. Yeah, I like that. We just have to be worried because we know they have counter spells. Well, we have. Like, we've signed a remand. I and mean, the Supreme Will. Sure. Yeah. It's your boy Tom. Have a good night, buddy. Enjoy your time, man. It's the best. It's the best. Oh, look, they have two of the counter spells in hand. <laughs> so stupid. Uh, I guess we'll take the remand. No, I like Supreme Will better, I think. Yeah, it's fine. Like, it's at least remand where, like, we get to the card back, and I don't think we're doing anything next turn, so... I mean, hopefully we'll... I mean, ideally we hit a, a swamp, but... Yeah, hopefully we hit a swamp, so we can actually cast the hit. We hit nothing. All right, so hey, I really hate that this one, yeah, two, three, four, up. five, six, seven. Uh, Nissa was the last thing we knew about, and then they played a botanical sanctum. <sighs> Forest. Nissa. With wings. Wings? What does that mean? Something to look forward to. Still rather win this game. Wing? I have no idea what that means. Going to eat wings? 
Oh, food, you mean? Yeah. Yeah. I'd still rather just win a game based on the quality of the plays rather than not being able to play anything. But we've gone through this before. Jesus. Seems good. That's <laughs> so fantastic. Oh, man, we're having a good time. Having a good time. Having a good time. See, Magic the Gathering is a weird game when you don't draw lands, and by weird I mean sad. Magic the Gathering is not a game when you don't draw lands. It's actually just a uh, a way to watch people do things. So that's, yeah, that's always cool. Yep. I just get to watch my opponent do cool things and wish that I could... Well, <laughs> good run. See you, friends. Good run. Thank you guys for watching. Really appreciate it. Slam those like and subscribe button. Check me out at mandatraders.com. You can find the link and promo code in the description if you're looking to... Uh, rent physical or digital cards and you can get 20 percent off for your first three months with the uh link in my description you can also check me out at meundies.com slash frank lapore you get 15 percent off there and use promo, promo code frank5 over at coolstuffinc.com all of those are options you can take and they're great ways to support the stream but otherwise i'm getting out of here thank you guys for watching i'll see you next time see you guys <laughs>